Now, Yusuf Aram. Yusuf's a political analyst at the TRT World News Channel. Good to see you. What is Turkey's goal here, and how likely is it that deploying Turkish troops to Libya will actually exacerbate the violence in the country? Well, when everyone looks at Libya, people are thinking gas and oil, eastern Mediterranean. But this deal, this maritime deal with Libya signed on November 27th is so much more than just uh, discovering oil and gas in the eastern Mediterranean. It's protecting Turkey's national security and its sovereignty. For years, uh, Greece and Greek Cypriots, other rivals, have been encroaching on uh, Turkey's, uh, Turkey's rights in the eastern Mediterranean. And this deal basically is halting this encroachment on uh, an annexation of the eastern Mediterranean uh, by protecting this maritime deal that was signed with the GNA. We know that there's tremendous pressure now on the GNA since the deal has been signed. Haftar has upped his offensive on Tripoli, and this troop deployment will be important. Now, and what kind the of powers that we're will it giving, be, Yusuf? What kind of size is it going to be? Will it be enough, do you think, to, to ensure Haftar's defeat, which is what Turkey, I suggest, wants? Well, Turkey doesn't want Haftar's defeat, or at least Turkey's not going there to combat Haftar, at least not initially. I expect a small deployment, probably a very immediate deployment of around 200 Marines there as a advise and assist uh, training role. Uh, the Turkish defense minister uh, stated that we don't plan on sending any combatant troops. Uh, the vice president has even hinted if Hafsar stops his offensive, uh, we may rethink a deployment. But that kind of seems a little, a little farther away now as the situation is quite dire in Tripoli. So I expect a very immediate deployment of 200 Marines there to serve as a stopgap. Uh, at least uh, raise the cost of Haftar's offensive on Tripoli, knowing that there is a Turkish presence, knowing that if any of them are harmed, there would be a much greater retaliation from Ankara uh, making